No officially returned to Rome in the upcoming movie Aqua and the Lost King. Now, this story upsets me, man. You know what upsets me? Why? Because we don't play by the same metrics no more. We don't. And we let never our did. biases run rampant, and we never acknowledge them. Mm. And it's a shame, bro. Because mm. we done seen many niggas get accused of shit, turns out be in this exact same position Amber Heard is in, and turns out they're lying, and they lose every opportunity. She she caused Johnny Depp millions of dollars. She lied on this nigga's name. Fuck the money. I'm sure he doesn't give a fuck about money. Niggas wealth. But it's about his reputation. It's about mm. like the, the shit she done dragged him in. The yeah, I think I think he, he definitely got taken off of uh, Pirates in the Caribbean. Definitely, if I'm not mistaken. They tried to get him back, though. But he said, fuck y'all. That probably cut him off because they believed the shit that she was mm. saying. We we all witnessed the trial. It was a very public affair. Boom, she's still in movies. And I know for a fact if it was the other way around, it would either take a very long time or that nigga would never see an opportunity this large again. Ever. For some reason, the Aquaman series is dedicated to have her on the show, to have her on the series as if like she's some prolific actor that can't be replaced. I didn't even know she was in, in Aquaman. She is. Yeah. And I'm, I'm saying she's such and a... And I refuse to watch him. I swear, I'm, swear I'm not watching him. Like yeah. she didn't lie. Like she didn't blatantly lie about a nigga for years. Now there's, now there's, there's, there's a bunch of like information that people are now trying to get out to like try to convince people like, Oh, it just wasn't one sided. And da, da, da. Let me let me let me be completely clear. I am not naive enough to believe that in a relationship that it's just one way. It's definitely both both parties have some influence in the outcome. The problem is though, is that y'all were willing to cancel and take money away to fame Don, Johnny Depp and didn't re, like go back and and try to rehabilitate the relationship or any of the roles that he had once it was once That's more bullshit. information it's was all given. all bullshit. Niggas wasn't you those know? same people weren't saying it's not only one story to the one. Yeah, one no. one side to the story when no. she was spitting her side of the story. They wasn't saying that. It's not that I'm I'm of the belief that it's just one side or I just think she completely lied and everything he said is the truth. It's not that. It's not. There is no extremes to this. They both played a part. The problem is that you all decided before they even went to trial to completely disregard, try to dismantle everything that he built up throughout his career and in the process of doing so, put a shield around her and everything she did. And the, it took a little bit of ounce of, of some questioning for them to put a pause on things, but here we are now, like not even a year removed from everything that happened, and she's already getting roles. And 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 look, I don't even think she shouldn't get the role. I just think I'm not gonna support that. But here's the issue for me: she didn't apologize. She didn't oh. admit. Ooh. She fought it in court. She argued yes. her point. She didn't back down. All time. The only thing that's it's just time passed. Yeah. It's not like she apologized. There was some redemption there. There was nothing. <laughs> she just. I actually switched from Chrome to Opera GX a while ago just because I was so tired of Chrome being the absurd resource hog that- Just let time That's go the, by. Like, That's it. I know the other way around is not moving like that, bro. Yeah. I know it's not. I, know. I know it's not. Oh, it's not, no. And it's that double standard, but that should be driving me crazy. I ain't gonna say it. Well, it, I ain't gonna say it's the double standard. It is, but I already, like, I ain't gonna say I already knew this was gonna happen, but it's what the world is, my nigga. I'm fortunate. It's crazy, though, because, again, he lost roles, all type of shit, money. His name looked crazy. Probably lost friends. Family probably looked at him a little crazy. That kind of shit, man. That kind of it's like keep saying it. Even e like in even even though he got proved in court that he didn't do this. Look at the conversation they just had at the beginning. Like we know that some like he participated probably like maybe like everything he said wasn't you know what I mean. So it's kind of like it looked crazy still because it's like the accus the mere accusation is just enough. Even though in court it was proven wrong and he was innocent and all that, you still like, now nah, he probably still did some of that shit. And it's like, damn. Damn. <laughs> Crazy. And it's that bias. You so got when cooked. people sit there and pretend like there's a patriarchy and women are just entirely disadvantaged by the current system in America, I, I'm like, bro, you can't think of examples like this yeah. where if you flip the roles and he was lying about her and didn't back down and there's a, a whole public trial and a back and forth and she lost millions of dollars and plenty of opportunities and her reputation was defamed for years. You think if he didn't, he didn't apologize, he didn't redeem himself in any way whatsoever, a year later he would still have roles on triple A films, on feature films? And it's impossible and let's again let me let's it's replay some of the unlikely. things that she blatantly lied about not not us jumping to conclusions not us it's siding one way or factually. another things that factually actually happened i fucking was hitting you i don't know what the motion of my actual hand was but you're fine i did not hurt you i did not punch you i was hitting you oh, you are such a baby grow the fuck up did you johnny start a physical fight? i did start a physical fight yeah, you did i was in fact taking a shower and she came banging on the door banging on the door banging on the door. i couldn't deal with any more of that so 
sarcastic, demeaning, aggressive, violent, toxic. You, she kept banging. Then I got out of the shower and I opened the bathroom door about that much so I could have a, a good hold on the door and in case she tried to burst in. I was right, she did. I was pushing her all the way on the door trying to get in. I, I didn't want to let her in because she was not in the best of moods. So when I pushing the bathroom door trying to close it, suddenly kind of yelled. She screamed out, ow, my toes or my foot or something. Possibly her foot had gotten caught under the door. I knelt down to have a look and when I knelt down on my hands and knees to look at her foot to see the injury, she kicked uh, the bathroom door into my head. I was completely taken aback by such a corrosive, horrific move. At this point, the door was open. I stood up and I said, what the fuck was that? The next move was just a bang. It just uh, clocked me in the jaw. And all of these things are like, not only is she on tape recording about physically uh, bopping this man, but I mean, like literally, they would have altercations where he's walking out and you can actively see this man being bodily harmed. Like you can, there's no question behind it. Yeah, you can go back and look at the trial so, if you need all the evidence. Everything yes. was laid out. A lot of it is proven factually. Some yes. of it is he say, she say. But regardless, I just know if he was the one hurting her and then he lied about it. Can and, you it imagine and he if caught on, on, on voice recording admitting that he actually did physically harm her then yeah, in the same instance tries to downplay it like we know that we know that big of a day you're such a baby i was just getting even you. hurt you it didn't like, even hurt you like she's admitting it but she's downplaying it and then like she's I I'll openly acknowledging it come on bro it's, it's not even it's not even the same realm of rules that we abide by bro so if if your true north star is empathy and you want good in the world then you would keep it equal. If someone did something fucked up, you would treat them the same way someone else did something fucked up. But the reality right. of this planet is that ain't happening. That ain't happening, kid. It is crazy though that she did. Like I'm, I, I'm not against people still making money. Like I understand that. It's, it's just a little crazy that she definitely, she definitely uh, violated son OD and just got that roll back. And they make no public statement. Apologizing for her behavior, I didn't say I was like even like the PR shit. Like I'm gonna seek therapy. Uh, I hope hopefully you guys will come with me on this journey and you forgive me. I was just I wasn't in the best of mindsets. My you know something like nothing at all. She gangster with it. I ain't gonna lie. Pick and choose when to apply their standards depending on whether or not they like the person, whether or not they're relatable to the person. Like there's plenty of examples in your life where you probably did the same thing. But when it's done by the legal system or by the people that have the ability to give brilliant opportunities, it's not like there's a lack of very star studded, talented female stars. There's no lack of that at all. So she's not the only one that could complete this role. And she's not even a great actor. She's so not. she could 100% be replaced. Yes. I don't know. That shit is just mind blowing to me, bro. Especially when it comes to the whole idea of like um, having a back and forth with, with men and women in terms of like uh, physical altercations and like how we're supposed to take that serious. This is another example of how it's just it's never going to be taken serious from the side yeah. uh, of, of women doing this to men when every single time it occurs, not only did the actual person who was committing the crime is sitting there telling the man it's not that big of a deal, it's fine, you didn't really get hurt, I didn't punch you, I was just hitting you. As a man, you know that. Down, that. Admitting that she did it, but downplaying the, the impact of it because regardless if he got hurt or not, like the lack of respect that you're doing, you have with somebody by just re re repeatedly just assaulting someone is crazy, like right? So like, it doesn't even matter if it hurts or not. That is just a crime in and of itself. That is a crime. And so the fact that that crime can be committed and then she knows in her mind that it don't really matter because I'm a woman and you're a man. And matter of fact, it matters so little that I'm going to openly admit this to you and then continue to downplay it. And then that gets literally displayed to the entire world. And then y'all still say, she can have a roll back. She can have a roll back. Yeah. I, you can see, tell people that it was a fair fight and see what the, see what the jury and judge think. Tell the world, Johnny. Yeah. Tell them, Johnny Depp. I, Johnny yeah. Depp, I'm, I'm a victim too of domestic violence. And yes. I know it's a fair fight. And see how many people believe or side with you. These how many people believe or side with you. It's like, there's like, no, there's no amount on, of evidence I think that can convince those people. You can move off your bias, that's fine, but they, it just, yeah, you don't treat, you don't treat assault seriously. You, you don't only treat at all. it seriously when it's happening to Not somebody right. you think is a vulnerable person. But I, I would argue completely rude, tarnishing a man's reputation and his opportunity. Nah, yeah, she violated. She tried to, she tried to. Vice versa is never happening. But this should get me tight. I'm not watching that series. I'm not watching the movies. I don't watch Aquaman just off the strength of that. I never watched him just off the strength of that. And I refuse to still to this point. I, I'm not going to say take it from the role. 
is their money. Yeah. Like the publishers are spending money on that film, and people are gonna go decide to watch it. Like everyone is participating she's not in that the creation of a role. Like, I'm not gonna say that, but I definitely agree with them. I mean, I never watched the awkward shit anyway, but yes, yeah, it's, it's uh, this shit is damning, bro. I get it. Like again, I don't want her to like fall off the face of the earth and not be able to take care of herself, but. It's not a, a, a slither level of, like, accountability here. For sure it's not. For sure it's not. So it's like, damn, man. That's unfortunate. Unfucking fortunate, man. I wonder what's going to happen with the film. I wonder if it's still going to do the numbers that it's supposed to do with or without her. I don't think... I don't really I don't really think so. I feel like the, the, the film is, is still going to do good. But I feel like... I don't know. I feel like people going to have mixed emotions about it, man. Let me know how y'all feel, man. Like, comment, subscribe, man. Tell me how y'all really be feeling about shit. Y'all comment here and there. Shout out to all the people that comment. Shout out to all the people that sub. You feel me? Shout out to all the people that spin a blog and actually just have a conversation with me. I'm going to write everybody back. Even if you're being sarcastic, a dickhead, whatever. You feel me? Horse and horse playing. I'm going to still fuck with you. You know why? I'm a real one, man. It's me, baby. It's me, nigga. It's me, nigga. You feel me? <laughs> it works.